A lot of the old subscribers probably recognize me. I know it's been a really long time, but to the new subscribers that aren't familiar with me, hello. And I'm so glad to be a part of this channel. I'm so glad to finally be working with Phil again. I think that COVID has definitely been a blessing in disguise because I wouldn't have had the time to be able to do this type of work before COVID hit. So I'm so glad to be here. But anyway, I didn't want to spend this whole video talking about myself. I wanted to talk about Sukiyana, Sukihaina, whatever her name is leaving OnlyFans and she had made a post on her page saying that she's leaving OnlyFans because let me read what she wrote um so Sukiyana says read. bye OnlyFans all I ever wanted was to get off government assistance be a good mother rapper business owner and wife I knew they would judge me for how I made my money but I stayed focused because struggling wasn't for me so there you have it f what people think get your money and handle your business because they're going to talk about you if you're broke or rich that's why i'm a baller now she claims to have made a million dollars this was back in august a million dollars while it is a lot of money is not enough to last forever and i think that the message that she and other creators are spreading is pretty dangerous because I've seen the rise of girls dropping out of college or not even going to college so that they can pursue an OnlyFans or Twitch or whatever streaming platform career because they feel that they're going to make the same amount of money as a well-known celebrity. A girl taking pictures with her iPhone in her bathroom is not going to make Bella Thorne or Sukiyana money. On average, the average girl OnlyFans makes $168 a month and if you scroll through Twitter you will see some of the most disgusting vile things being posted by these girls on OnlyFans it's almost like it's almost like some type of demon possession I had never seen people sink to this low for money and like I said they're not even really making any money so you doing all this Posting these videos that are going to be out forever for $168 a month. You can go to Sheets, Panda Express. You can, I mean, there's so many other things that you can do right now. I understand that not everybody wants to, wants to risk working outside because of COVID, but there are so many other things you can do. Not everybody's going to be rich doing this. And I think that People really should take a step back and really think. If you can't put your face in it, don't post it. I mean, this whole get your money by any means necessary mentality is dangerous. It is having girls go down a really, well, girls, men and women, go down a really dangerous path. The adult film industry chews people up and spits them out and leaves them with nothing. I have seen so many people get into this line of work and yes you can make a lot of money in a short period of time but once that money runs out and nobody wants to date you you can't find another job your friends and family disown you it's not worth it there are so many people that you that I've followed not, not that I'm a big you know, I don't really watch a whole lot of that, but I always will look at them and then say, I'm going to check back in a couple years and see what they look like. And there's some women that there's a girl in particular that I follow that within a year, she's, she drinks all the time. She smokes. She's always buying stuff. It's almost like you're trying to hide the pain or you're trying to use all these different things to fill the hurt that's inside, all that emptiness that's inside by putting yourself out there. I know that a lot of people are saying, oh, don't shame, don't shame sex workers, but people really have to think. Yes, Sukiyana might be okay because she's a different, she's, her situation is completely different. She was already on TV. She's already in the media. And so she may be able to start focusing on her music and be able to step away from this but the average person won't 
especially our people we shouldn't don't do this do not sit there and charge five dollars a month and show everything because it's not gonna last but anyway i appreciate you all for watching and i will see you soon